Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Vime and today I'm going to show you how to use Codebreaker Cheats on SPSX2 on Xbox. This will also work for PCSX2 and AetherSX2. In this video, I will be using the Codebreakers version 10. I bet, and now what we're going to do is head over to our games list and open up Codebreakers. I bet now this is the main menu for code breaker you can use the d-pad to navigate through the options so you should see select sheets device manager code breaker chat options and also day one we're going to head over to the second option and press a on select sheets now this is the games list these are all the available games that have codes for cheats you can use the d-pad up and down to navigate or you can use the right trigger to go down by the letters or use the left trigger to go up by the letters in this example, we will be doing Need for Speed Underground. So I'm going to head over to the ends and look for Need for Speed Underground. And then press A on it. I bet. So for Need for Speed Underground, there's 206 sheets available. What you want to do is you want to make sure to click on Enable Code. You want to make sure that this is enabled first or your cheats will not work. And then I'm head down and look through the cheats. And then I think I'm going to select Unlock Everything. So just make sure to click A on the cheats that you want. And then once you're finished, all you would have to do is press the Start button. All right, and then once we get back to the menu, now at the bottom, you should see that it says your game has been selected and it should show how many cheats you've selected for the game as well. All you would have to do is press left on the D-pad, go to the disc icon that says start game. And then once it says, please insert game, make sure not to press anything. And then we're gonna go into our quick menu. For me, it's start and select. And then what you wanna do is go down and change disc. You should see the menu showing all your games. And then what we're going to do is look for the game that you're doing this for. And then make sure to press A. You should see please wait and then it should start your game. I bet now I'm going to head over to quick race. And then I'm gonna show you that all the cars are now unlocked. And then once I pick out a car, you can see that I now have all the maps unlocked. All right, so another tip is if you don't wanna have to go into the Code Breakers game to set up your cheats again, what you could do is make sure not to save onto your memory card, but you could go into your quick menu and make sure to save it as a save state. So head over to your save state, make sure to save it. And then anytime you want to go back into your game that has the cheats enabled, then just load back into that. And that's pretty much about it. If this video helped you out, make sure to give this video a like and follow for more videos.